What is up guys, Tomcat here, and today I have a little vlog for you guys while I'm on a bit, bit, bit of a vacation. Um, the reason why I haven't been really responding to the comments lately is because I took a vacation for kind of like a, almost a week long uh, after I did my trip to New York with the Forza RC, which the vlogs for that are coming very soon. Uh, if you haven't seen those yet, they're gonna be coming uh, this week. Uh, and this is kind of like a precursor to those to let you guys know that they are coming. But this video has been in the works for a few weeks now. Um, a friend of mine just recently got a really nice Subaru STI hatch and it's making, I think, around the neighborhood of 400 all-wheel horsepower. It might be a little bit more than that. Um, I'll have to see and talk to him about it once we get to, uh, once we meet up with him. But um, the car should be really, really fun to drive and uh, it'd be interesting to see how it compares to the, last, uh, to the last car I drove, which was that R8 V10, if you watched that video. But uh, we're gonna go meet up with him and the road we were originally gonna drive on, apparently, he, he just texted me and told me that that road is closed off. Apparently, uh, the police have that road closed off. I guess somebody uh, had a crash or something. Uh, but um, we'll either find a different road or uh, or maybe that road will be open by the time we go uh, or by the time we get there. But regardless, we're gonna go meet up with him right now. And uh, once we get there, I'll catch up with you guys and show you guys around the car. built WRX making in the neighborhood of 450 horsepower uh, he hasn't dynoed it so he doesn't know exactly how much power he's making the competition clutch is really stiff really stiff I'm gonna put the windows up just a little the uh, the steering wheel is really nice this like it's like a suede flat bottom steering wheel really really nice Really nice. The suspension is a little stiff, but not too bad. Um, I would say that, we'll say the clutch is, the clutch is really stiff. Uh, really, really, really stiff. Uh, has a lot of spring back to it too. Um, let me see. <laughs> okay, that's, 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 that's good. Yeah, that's good. I, I, I'm, yeah. <laughs> That, uh, that sound makes me very pleased. Just trying to get used to the clutch. You really have to muscle it down. It's a really stiff unit. Okay, I'm on third. You find third? Okay. <laughs> I will do second gear later. I'm not gonna do second gear right now. Can I turn around here? Yes, I can. Uh, kind of, I hope. 
Oh, geez. Okay, yeah, one lane bridge, but I can turn around. The suspension is not too stiff. Um, it is on coilovers and it is lowered quite a bit, but it's not overly stiff. It's not like, you know, bouncing up and down all the time. It's not stupidly stiff, which is a really nice thing when you see a car that's like this low, you're like, oh man, that's gonna ride like crap. But it doesn't, it actually rides really, really nicely. Rides really nicely, I would say. Especially in comparison to some of the other really low cars I've driven, this thing rides really well. Really, really well. And get, oh, dude, a tractor going out that way. Come on, bro. Clutch bucks a little bit, but it doesn't buck too bad. clutch dude is <laughs> oh my god it's heavy it's really heavy it's really really heavy back down the hill now god oh my god the sounds the sounds are what make this car for me every car that I drive I there, there's I usually end up walking away with one reason or another that I like about it, one thing or another that I really like about it, and in this, it's all the sounds. I mean, I've driven a lot of turbo cars before. I know what turbo cars sound like, but this, 
has such a soundtrack. It, it just... Oh my god. It's a little tricky to heel toe. I'll be honest, it's a little tricky to heel toe with the pedal placement. But, but, it's not, a, it's not something you couldn't get used to. Wow. <laughs> it's, it's definitely not something you couldn't get used to with time. But yeah, you would have to get, you'd have to get used to this pedal placement. I would have to get used to this pedal placement, I, I, I guarantee. Oh, oh my god. Well, I would venture a guess that the rotors are a bit warped. I'm getting, oh yeah, I'm definitely getting steering wheel pulsing under braking. It doesn't like to fall off boost, that's for sure. Like, it doesn't like you to come off boost and then get back on it again. Coming off a of boost and then getting back on it again is like this car's worst nightmare. It hates it. But when you're on it, it's awesome. When you're on it, it's awesome. When you're on and off, eh, I, I think that's where it might be able to use a little work. But when you're on it, oh my God, this car is a monster when you're on it. It's an absolute monster when you're on it. One la little last pull. <laughs> God, it's so good. It's so good, guys. Well, that was an awesome, awesome, awesome time. That was an awesome time, and it's an awesome car. All-wheel drive is something I don't really have that much experience with, but... Oh man, it's good, it's really good.